it, but we're really just going to celebrate, celebrate because the mm. album is the number one world music album in, in on the planet. Today. And we've never released a world music album before. Mm. So tonight we may change the script from <laughs> trying to give the backstory and just let's have a drink yeah. and, and just, just listen just, to the music and, yeah. and have fun. And then we head off to do a music video with Shata Wale for the next, the next single, Ready, okay. which also features Jose Chameleon. And the UK, here we come. Yeah. And then the World Tour kicks off at the New Orleans Jazz Heritage Festival on wow. May 4th. World Tour, how long are you going to go for? Um, I think it w right now we're doing spot dates because last year was so heavy on yeah. us, you know, with the loss of our father, mm. Mr. Denra Morgan. And we still went out there because our father would have want us mm. to go do your work. Yeah. You, know? <laughs> you know, that's how we were raised, very militant yeah. and very serious. Mm. So even though he had passed away, we still had to go on tour we because tour. we knew that's what that's our what father would want. Yeah, man. Yeah. So this year we're celebrating our culture. Mm. We're celebrating our, our success of the, the amount of time that we've been in this music and bringing Africa and Jamaica mm. together. Mm. So, you know, like Peter said, we're going to be performing alongside people like Jill Scott at the New Orleans Jazz Festival, Ed Sheeran, um, Angela Kijo, Wu-Tang Clang. It's a big festival mm. in New Orleans. So to represent m reggae music <coughs> with the Homeland album on that show, yeah. we're going to feel very like... No, I'm sure you are. Yeah, oh, I'm sure you are. Yeah. <laughs> we're going to no, feel good. It's a huge <laughs> album. I mean, oh, man. Yeah. Now... In terms of longevity and in terms of, let me say, power and influence yeah. um, uh, musically, what would you say is more important, the practice of music or spirituality behind the music? I would say the practice behind music because with music, some people use music as in gospel music, it is, mm. it is used to preach the word of, okay. of Christ, mm. right? It mm. is a spiritual experience. Mm. But you have some people that utilize music to party. Okay. So you can't just put music for just one purpose. Mm. Mm. You know, when Saul came to heal the king, it was a, it was a thing where it was healing. It mm. was a, so it, music mm. has many multiple, yeah. 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 yeah, music has yeah. multi-purpose. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So okay. for us, yes yeah, spiritual mm. and when people listen to this album a lot of people you know this thing is done out in a million streams already it's not even 24 hours so the people that are connecting it is not even a lot of our reggae fans that okay. love you do a yeah. dj to be yeah. rap and tell me how come <laughs> down by the river so then when they listen to it they're like "Ooh, yeah. this mm. is a conceptual album mm. that we are building the bridge from the mm. diaspora to mm. Africa mm. to encourage people to come to Africa mm. whether you want to live invest or just to visit the yeah. same way you visit London mm. or Miami mm. this is what we want this album to invoke so it's not really a full reggae album yeah. you know I was telling our brother cash this morning when it went number one we were celebrating now my brother Papa Laji we said it's number one and it's not the reggae album chart it's the, the world, world music, music chart. chart and this is a first That's for us so I want to take the time. Yeah. Which camera am I? In the middle. 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 Ladies and gentlemen, I want to take the time to big up my brother Mojo. Yes. Because yes. this album, I'm so proud of him. Because throughout the time, I mean, we went through a lot from this album was being made even when our father wasn't, you know, about to make his transition. And he has worked so hard. We all have children. We all have families, mm. you know, trying to but we still have to continue the work. So to make it through, I'm so proud of him because he's worked so diligently with our label CTBC Music Group, which means cool to be conscious music, <laughs> right? So cool we, you know, so yeah. he's been a champion on this album. Of course, Peter is an incredible songwriter and I'm still growing as a songwriter. So as a team, but he's really championed him. So Mojo, in front of the world, I'm proud of you. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Wow. Yeah, man. Appreciate wow. it over here. Wow. He's done an amazing job. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe a quick one more freestyle for us. Please, <laughs> please, please, please. please. Right, we're going to do a classic. <laughs> okay. Yeah. All right. You don't have to dread to, to be Rasta. Rasta. You don't have to dread. This is not a dreadlock thing. Divine, Divine conception, conception of your heart. heart. River Jordan. Don't, don't be afraid of Jehovah burning fire. fire. Oh, no. Just in just fire and you never get burned. Oh, 
The fire that reigns over heat, air, and water. As you tell them, no water can put out your fire. The fire gonna leave Rasta higher. You don't have to dread to be Rasta. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Morgan Heritage. Yes, I Thank are. you so much. Yeah, Thanks for having us, David. Thank you so much. Yeah, yeah, it's a pleasure. Man. It's been fantastic. Yeah. Go out and stream it. Run it up. Yes. Run it up. Go out and stream it. It's available on Boom Play, which is a great platform for African music. Yeah. Go and check it out on Boom Play, Spotify, Tidal. And make sure all of our fans, please follow us on social media. We want to engage. Mojo is on there. Peter will answer you. I may answer you. So Audio follow us. Too. Audio Mac. Follow us iTunes. at Morgan Heritage, iTunes. <laughs> Follow <laughs> us at Morgan Heritage, and we will. We want to big up to our brethren, Shatawale, Stoneboy, Rocky <laughs> Doheny, because we are in Ghana. Yes, yeah, thank you. Yeah, we fantastic. did it. Number one, number one. Number one, world yes. music charts. Now, it's uh, tonight, it's where? Oasis? Uh, 10 p.m. at Oasis Lounge. Okay. So get there early, because it's going to fill up really, really fast. All right. How do they... How do they um, we had push back the time. <laughs> how did they get involved? 12 p.m. They, they 8 p.m. Uh, it's it's yeah. only by special invitation. Special invitation. Yeah, right. so, so the media, if you're a media house, if, come on out. But it's not, it's not an open public. Okay. We're just giving All the right. media a chance okay. and the industry. Okay. So, Super. you know, we're going to be there with our music industry friends, yeah. you know, my Reggie Rockstow, yeah, the Chateau yeah. Alley, the, the Rocky <laughs> Lane, the people. But it's not a full Morgan, yes. it's not Morgan yes. Heritage in yes. concert. No, no. Stay tuned. Yeah. So if you got the invite from, you know, our CTBC team yeah. over at Rave Media, you know, make sure yeah, you there. reply and RSVP. Super. Big up the entire team and Rudy Kwachi and everybody all right. for all that they're doing for us. Thank Fantastic. you. Fantastic. Thank you very much uh, to Morgan Heritage. It's been a wonderful conversation. Well, you know, I just love their music and their energy and their, you yes. know, their togetherness is everything. And I just love the fact that um, they've been around for this long, leaving a very good example, you know, for the rest of the younger creatives.